Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Wednesday, so let's watch a record on Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, March... I think the 8th. <laughs> I can't remember, to be honest. I have no idea what it is. I know it's Wednesday. But anyways, I got two whips to share with you, and they're new whips because I got kind of tired of working on the big projects that I'm working on. If you hear noise in the background, it's Jesse. He is listen to videos. I hope it's not too loud. Actually, I need to check and see how loud it is real quick. Okay, it was a little loud, so I have to, uh, had him turn it down for a minute. Anyways, I got two new whips I'm going to share with you. They're my groomers because I wanted a break from the big projects I'm working on, which is a project for the seasonal yarn YouTube swap hop <laughs> and uh, the crochet sweater along that I'm doing. So it's two kind of bigger projects and I wanted a break from that. So, um, I started to Emma Grooms. <laughs> and then after I show you that, I will announce the winner for the project bag um, from my sister's shop opening. <laughs> but we'll talk about that after this. All right, so first I started a Pokemon because um, on March the 18th is Pokemon Community Day in the game that's called Pokemon Go, which is on your phone. And if you don't know what that is, it is a game that requires you to get up out of your house and move around to play it. Um, accurately you know you have to get out and search for pokemon and get supplies and stuff by walking around your town and stuff and it's a lot of fun me and devin has played it on and off since 2016 and then now jesse has wanted to start playing it so we've been playing it all together and it's a lot of fun it's a good way to get outside and get exercise and just have fun as family um because most parks and like downtown areas where you would walk around with your family anyways have pokey stops everywhere and stuff so it's a lot of fun but anyways um Every month they have a community day, which is where they spotlight a special Pokemon, like a particular Pokemon, where a bunch of them spawn in and you can catch special ones. Um, and then they also have like um, bonus things that's going on that day. And it lasts for uh, like, uh, like four hours, I think. Anyways, this next common one is March the 18th and it is for a Pokemon called Slowpoke, which if you don't know anything about Pokemon, you don't know that. <laughs> but it's a pink uh, thing. So... I started it, <laughs> and this is a paper pattern. I got it actually off a of Ribbler, um, which I had heard of that, and I actually had an account on there, but I never like purchased anything through it. Um, but I downloaded the app when, because I found this pattern, I wanted it, and it was only available on Ribbler, and so I downloaded the app and I purchased it. The day I purchased it, it was half off, so it was two dollars, um, and it. I love the app. Like it, it has the whole pattern right now, and then every time you do finish a row, you can click on it and it marks it out and then it keeps track of where you're at I think that's really cool but uh, anyways I wrote down the person's name it's not their name but it's their crochet name <laughs> and I, then I looked up how to pronounce it and then I forgot but I think it's um Zycote Amigurumis and it was a paper pattern but I got this much done so far so I got its head its mouth and eyes and all that and its body done I do got to make four legs a big tail and then it has two like curly ears that I've got to make and sew onto him. But I'm using all worsted weight yarn. And the hook is a F hook, which is 3.75 millimeter. The pattern calls for um, a much smaller hook. It's like a tube point something. But so I'm working on him, get him done. I want to get him done before community day so that I can put him in the truck that day. I like doing that. I've done that before in the past with Pokemon. Whatever community day it is, I put it in like our windshield while we're out walking around. I just thought it was cute. So the other Pokemoners will see it and you know, know what it is. And the second whip that I started um, is actually a free pattern, but it's also a paper pattern <laughs> by Olive at Stringy Ding Ding. And it is her ice cream sandwich. She came out with it pretty recently. And I love ice cream sandwiches, and I just thought it was such a cute pattern. So I did start it. So far, I got the ice cream done. I went ahead and made it all white because that's the kind that we buy is the all white ones. Hers has the chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla on it. But I made my all white, and it's all ready to be stuffed. I got to the point where it needs to be stuffed. And then I got to make the cookie that goes on the front and the back. Uh, and do the face and all that so but I got it going so again I'm using all worsted weight yarns this was actually a scrap ball I almost used it all up <laughs> but there's still a little bit on there and then the hook I'm using for it is a G 4.5 so it's like a G it's a 7 it's a 7 <laughs> it's like the G plus or whatever and uh, it is a free pattern but on her website but you can also buy it if you want it in a PDF format but that's the two things that I'm working on actively right now I do still have other projects I just haven't really picked them up <laughs> I really ought to but I just haven't so let me know in the comments down below what you guys are working on and feel free to share any links and stuff like that. And now we're going to do the giveaway winner. So um, 
starting from, I think it was the 1st through yesterday the 7th. Yeah, so today is the 8th. <laughs> uh, anyone who purchased a sticker from my sister's Etsy shop for every purchase you made. So if you ordered 10 stickers, you got 10 entries. Um, got entered into the giveaway. So there was a total of 205 entries. So she sold 205 stickers. Uh, and I think in a bunch of the first order she got, she included a free sticker. Uh, that was the No Catch Your Name sticker. So I don't know how many people got that, but some of y'all got some that. <laughs> and then the number that was drawn was number 157. I did a random uh, number generator. And that is Holly. I'm going to mess up your last name, but it's like, I think it's Mal Maldondo. <laughs> Maldonado. I don't know how to say it. I'm sorry. But uh, I recognize your name because you've purchased from me before. But so you won the custom-ish bag. So you get to choose whether you want a drawstring bag or a tote bag with handles and like the snap closure. Um, and then you can kind of pick like the color scheme that you would like or like if you want a floral print or uh, if you like a certain cartoon character or something like that. I could try to find something that matches that. So um, contact me through email. It's in the description box and let me know uh, what kind of bag you want and what print-ish you want and I will get onto it. It may take a week or two for me to get around to making it just because life is busy, but I will make it eventually and send it out to you. <laughs> and uh, also, I think I might start doing a giveaway through my sister's shop to help her. <laughs> and because um, I know a lot of y'all are going to love her stickers more than just when they come out because she's working on a bunch of new designs. I've been helping her with new ones. She's been showing me some new ones. and I'm super excited for them. And she's also hoping to make knitted theme ones soon along with maybe magnets. Um, we actually purchased some uh, magnet sheets that her Cricut can cut through. So we're going to be trying to make magnets and potentially other things in the future. So definitely go favorite her shop. I'll leave it down below. It's going to be in all my videos from now on down below. Um, heart it so that you can, you know, get it boosted. Heart all the stickers you love. Buy all the ones you love. And keep looking up for more because um, we're working on a lot of different designs. So I think what I'm going to do is every month, maybe from like the first of the month through the seventh of the month, uh, any of those purchases in the first hunk of the month <laughs> will go towards the giveaway, I think. I think that's what I'm going to do. But anyways, congratulations, Holly. And thank you, everyone who supported my sister. Um, so, yeah. But she's got some new designs coming out that are really cool. And I can't wait for y'all to see them because I love them. I'm super excited about. And uh, I guess that's it. I'm going to go ahead and hop off right here. And I'll see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.